Michaela, this is such an exceptional series for you. I think it's the perfect follow-up to The Unicorn for you. Oh, thank you. There's something about Jane or the script itself that drew you to be a part of the series? Um, I, 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 you know what it is? It's like, um, it's kind of a combo platter on this one where it was shooting in England. Who doesn't want to go to England for five months? You know what I'm saying? Uh, but also, you know, because like on its face, if you just say like playing a mom who makes dinner, I'd be like, oh, barf. But I really... <laughs> loved um the kind of the tone of the script and meeting john beckerman who, you know the creator and the showrunner and he was so uh delightful and and had such an invitation for us to come and play together and um and 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 i felt like i'd be able to bring I, I, my thing to it so it's not just a role that like anybody could do but maybe it's like a role that that I, that it is made for me. And then the writers and, you know, we can collaborate so much and otherwise like why do anything? And then this incredible cast comes on and they're all at the top of their game in terms of improv and, and, uh, and just funny, funny bones and really nice people, not for nothing. So I just knew I was going to enjoy going to work every day with all these people. And I knew I was going to go enjoy where I was going to work. And and then that we would just see what happens. And I, I feel like when I watched the show uh, recently, I just was like, oh, it worked. I, I, I'm i laughing and I was there and I'm still laughing. So th I'm pretty sure it's funny. I think my funny meter is okay. Yeah. And so I, 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 I don't know. Um, so I think it was like all the elements, right? Well, in case you didn't know, Dan Bakedell told me, they said Michaela Watkins is a part of this. And he said, I'm in whatever she, he, they're like, but the details are, and he's like, nope, if Michaela's doing it, I'm doing it. <laughs> oh, okay. that's so sweet. You know, yeah, he's awesome. He's like, again, like just, he's one of the best improvisers I've ever seen. And <laughs> he's so funny. One, I mean, he gets me good. How many spit takes did I do, Daniel? Like, oh, yeah, laughing. quite a lot. Yeah, I asked him about the improv too, and he said he's pinching himself the entire time you're filming these hilarious scenes because he has to try to keep a straight face. And I think that's the mark of a great comedic series when even the actors are trying to keep it together during every single take uh, at these dinners. And Daniel, this is such an exceptional series for you too. I have to ask how much of your lines were improv and how much were scripted because I think your character is sort of a standout in the series because you're sort of an antagonist to, yeah. <laughs> to so many, <laughs> to your brother yeah. at this point. Uh, you, you're spraying him in the face. I can't, at that point, there's moments, he says he missed you, even, you know, th th talk about how, how much of your work was improv. Honestly, a good a good chunk of it uh, landed. Like like it, it's not just the lines either. Some of it's the physical moments. Like for example, there's a moment where he and I have to kind of keep these like Germans uh, sort of tucked away and out of sight from our parents, and and we we get through like a mini mission and we've succeeded. And so, you know, Henry Hall playing my brother, he he holds his hand up to give me a high five, and I look at it. And I and I go to do the high five and then I, you know, I just dab on him real quick. And that was not scripted um, there. And it just kind of felt organic. You know, I had to access that younger sibling energy for myself to get there, you know. Uh, but no, uh, it was very uh, it was very fun. There was a lot of room to play. It was like it was like telling kids to go play on the monkey bars like we were able to do anything. I mean, we, you know, um, uh, yeah. You name it, we we were just able to be like, can we get another take? It was like, yeah, sure. You know, it was it was great. Yeah, I, I mean, there's so many great moments to this series, Michaela. Thank you. You and Dan must have been having trouble after trouble keeping it together in so many moments. He mentioned when Nana gets drunk, and I think that Carol is just an exceptional addition to this family as well. What were some of the moments you had, Michaela, trying to keep it together? You mentioned a, a little bit. <laughs> Oh, like when Dan was um, sweating and burping and trying oh, to tell uh, Henry's character that his the his presumed girlfriend was having someone else's baby, 
and kept like and they put all this fake sweat on him it was so realistic and the burps were, were so realistic I don't know why but it got me so good and I just couldn't look at him I was like I, I can't I can't and then this one over here Daniel Thrasher and Henry and Carol like they just kill me I don't know everybody's so funny and they all slotted into their characters seamlessly and and from day one Daniel I'm like this is your first series where do you get off being this good this early in your career you, oh my gosh I know you're not early in your career you have a huge other life no, no, no. but I just mean to jump into a series and to like and to just own that character so outright it was it was fabulous it was fabulous watching you but then watching the edit and just seeing all the little things that I missed or the scenes that I wasn't there for that you were shooting and just being like god you bring so much nuance and so much like your your comedy's tight your comedy is tight thank you so much Michaela I appreciate it I loved watching you too I was like really rooting for you the whole time oh <laughs> the the, the hip-hop dance that that they do god they nope. do this, like, break into this hip-hop dance, and I couldn't, that was killing me. I was going to ask you, I go, was that scripted, or did you all sort of formulate it on your own? I mean, it certainly wasn't choreographed. Uh, just Henry and I were like, what do you want to do? <laughs> like, what are we going to do? The, the, the dance was scripted, but the, like, we knew we had to do it. But I think we just, you know, honestly, we both just busted out our best moves, Jamie. They're both musicians, so... So, so what you see is the dance of just musicians. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's what you get. <laughs> so come for the parents, stay for the incredible beatbox. Stay, stay, that's right. So stay for the goofballs. Exactly. I mean, <laughs> this series has heart. There's insane humor to it. And I was telling everyone that it gives you those needed laugh tears that you just get from a favorite show. Michaela, is that what you think is going to make it such a fast fan favorite series that people can relate to it, but also just get such a break that needed laugh that you need right now? Yeah, right. We need it so badly. That was the other thing. When you asked why I did this series, I'm like, I just want to laugh. I just want to do something really silly. I was coming off a movie that was kind of like, you know, a woman really going through it. And I just thought I need to do straight up silly because we need it. Everything is so darn depressing. And I, I mean, I need it. I need, I need, I need it. I need it. I need to watch it or I need to do it. And I hope you're right. I hope it is a big hit because I want to go back and do some more. I don't know what I'm going to do. I can't look at my phone. It's not a good place. 